2 Peter chapter 1, verse 20. Knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. Shalom, Israel. This is the brother Kalar from the GMS Dallas camp. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Again, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Also, I want to give a double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that do rule well. Peace and love to you, brothers out there that are kicking his word in sincerity and truth, and to the few sisters that do listen, and blessings to the elect. The reason I want to bring up this verse, man, is because I was just reading over this article that I was seeing, and it was talking about the many denominations under Christianity. And, you know, <clears throat> and a lot of scriptures popped into mind, you know, about being on one accord. And I was just reading this article here, man. It's called the um, Facts and Stats on 33,000 Denominations, the 20,000, 30,000 number, and David Barrett's Statistics Part 2. It's has some, you know, some pretty interesting information within it, man. It just shows, you know, that that these are, are out of all these uh, <clears throat> uh, denominations under Christianity, they all have their own interpretation of what the scriptures mean, man. You know, here you got an Adventist. Um, Baptist, Christian Brethren, Congregational, Disciple, um, the Dunker, whatever, the Exclusive Brethren, the Angelic evangel Evangelical, um, the Fundamentalist, the holiness, Holiness, Lutheran, the Methodist, it just goes, the list goes on, man. You know, you got some more down here, it just, it keeps going, and all of these are under the, the so-called banner of um christianity man and i just was thinking man like as much as the scripture said to be on one accord and that there's no private interpretation of a script of the scriptures like how can you have that many denominations how can you say how can you say that you know you're you're, you're under the the christian banner which means followers of you know christ which you know his name to be yahweh like how can you still be on that one accord, man? I'm just going to get some scriptures, man, just to go into this. Um, I got Romans 15 and 6. That ye may with one mind and one mouth glorify Yahweh, even the Father of our Lord, Yahweh Shammashiach. So they said with one mind and one mouth. Like, that means all together, man. You know, that means that the one mind it's, it's, it's a like mind. It's, it's, we all doing and, and preaching the same thing. You know, there's no, you know, other way. Well, I see it this way or maybe we could kind of, you know, see it that way. No. There's no private interpretations of the scriptures, man. And I just like I said, I just don't get how me how if you can be under the banner of Christianity and you have thirty three thousand plus denominations mean that means all of y'all feel like your way is right and nobody is going with truth and everybody's okay with that you know everybody's okay with well you might see something a little different in there as long as we all believe you know it's all good but you might see a little something different i don't know that's how they feel man no there's no private interpretation of scriptures man let me get um Psalms, um, 133, start at verse 1. Behold, how good and how pleasant is it for brethren to dwell together in unity. That word unity, man, I want to go into that word right quick, man. Because, you know, unity means all together as one, you know. So let's get this word. In the Hebrew is Yachad. Strong's H thirty one sixty two. Yachad. Yachad. And it means all together with all union, unitedness, together, all together, all together alike. You know? Like 
it, it doesn't mean it, it's similar. You know, you can't do, you know, similar things, man. It has to be togetherness. It has to be unity, you know, and like that under the, 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 30, the 33,000, the 30, 30, 30,000 30, plus denominations under Christianity, man, like they are similar. They're not alike. They're not doing, they're not doing everything in unity. Everybody has their own interpretation. Like I was saying, man, one person might believe that, you know, um, Yahweh Shai <clears throat> was Michael, or you know, Yahweh Shai was is 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 the most high in 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 a, in a fleshly body. And all of this, they you know, that that holy trinity doctrine, all this, you know, is under the banner of, of, of so called Christianity, man. Like you said, and they all feel like, well, as long as you believe, it, it's all good. We we're we're all, you know, together. No, man. Unity. It means alike. Could be like minded, man. Get another scripture, man. This is um First Corinthians chapter one, verse ten. Now I beseech you, brethren, by the name of all Lord Yahweh Shah Mashiach, that, that ye all speak the same thing, and that there be no division among you, but that you be perfectly joined together in the same mind and in the same judgment. Now it said that we speak the same things, man. That means that you can't see it that way and I see it this way and we still be on the same accord. That's not speaking the same thing, man. You know, they feel like if, like I said, they feel like if you just believe in Jesus, that it's all good. That no matter what your interpretation of it is, that you, you straight, you know. But that's not the case, man. It said that we speak the same thing and that there be no division among you. No division. That means your, your interpretation and my interpretation has to be the same. I can't call myself a Baptist. You can't call yourself an Adventist. And we say we believe the same thing, man. You know? But that ye be perfectly joined together in the same mind and in the same judgment. Like, if, we, if we're speaking the same things, man, and there's no division among us, then that's, that's that. That's that. What he's talking about? That we be perfectly joined together. We perfectly joined together because being of one of being of one of one accord. Being of one accord means that basically y'all doing everything alike. Like you said, <clears throat> of course y'all aren't aren't the, the the same brother. But we're trying. They say to follow the Lamb whithersoever you go, it man. And if you're not following Yahweh Shai, doing the things that Yahweh Shai did. Then how can you call yourself a follower of Yahweh? It don't make no sense, man. You know? A few more scriptures. I'm gonna get about here, man. That few more. This is Romans 12, starting at verse 4. For as much as we have and they'll like I I, I seen <clears throat> I was watching the video as well. I'm gonna try to put the link in uh in the comments, Lord willing, if I can find it, it might be in the history. Um, but I was watching this video where they just tried to use this verse to justify the fact that that's why that there is that many denominations within Christianity, so-called Christianity. Romans chapter 12, verse 4, For as we have many members in one body, and all members have not the same office, so we, being many, are one body in Yahweh Shai, and every one member one of another. See, they'll try to use that part where it says, not have not and all members have not the same office but we know what that means man you know like we go into it, it it means the rank man you know within within the camp everybody ha, ha, has has a, a a different thing to do man you might bring a different a different you know um you might bring a a, a different thing to the body but you're all on one accord. It's not like you're doing something different, you know. When your mind is 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 on the same accord, your feet gonna walk the same, man. They're gonna take different steps, but they're gonna be going in the same direction, you know. And that's how we are, man. You know, within with with within Great Millstone. You know, don't we we don't we don't preach different doctrines, man. You know, um. 
the camp in Dallas say something different than the camp in 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 um in New York. Or the the New York camp say something different from the um camp in LA. It's not like that, man. You know, it says so we being many are one body in Yahawasha, Amashiach, and every one member one of another. That's what it means. We're one of another, man. We, we're, we're on the same accord, man. We're speaking the same things. You know, we're being like-minded. We're not preaching different different, um, different ideologies and, and different doctrines, man. Like, I was, like it's, it's, when, I, when I said that, a, a movie came to mind, um, the movie Drumline. You know, before they go out on the field, or before they go perform, they have this thing that they say is called one band, one sound. I mean, they're all together. Nobody doing nothing different, man. It's one band, one sound. That's how we is within GMS, man. It's, it's, it's just, we're, we're within this thing. We're, we're, we're one accord, you know, one mouth, one body. We all speak the same thing and do the same thing, man. And that's following your house, shot. One more scripture, man. This is Philippians 2, verse 2. Fulfill ye my joy, that ye be like-minded, having the same love, being of one accord, of one mind. And that's basically it, man. You know? You have to be like-minded. We're not, we're not trying to divide the doctrine to try to fit everybody's life, man, and saying at the end of that, that, okay, if you believe, then it's cool. No, we all have to do the same thing that Yahweh did, man. The same thing that the disciples did. The same thing that the prophets did before us, man. We have to do these same things, man. You know, there's, like, like I said at first, there's no private interpretation of the scriptures, man. You can't make the scriptures fit your life, man. You have to fit your life within to the scriptures. There's no way around that, man. You can't live how you want to live and, 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 and following and saying that you're a follower of Yahweh Shah. Because you're not, man. That's a lot. 30,000 30, 30 plus, 30, 30, plus denominations, man. And y'all, all, all of them have a, 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 different, a, a different interpretation. But yet they're all Christians. It don't make no sense, man. That's why the scriptures preach of, of uh, preach and teach of being as one. A body. Not bodies. One body. One mouth, one mind. One accord. You know? And that's how we're supposed to live it, man. But that's all I got, man. Lord willing, that lesson was edifying to you, brothers, man. With that being said, I want to say, call halal, yahweh, shimmy, I was shy. Double orders to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that do real well, and blessings to the elect. Shalom.